Yeah. Okay, guys, so this is the Amiga sampler. Uh, this works with a program called Master Sound. I do have the discs there somewhere for it, um, although it might need a bit of restoration. But this is what I used to use back in the day to sample all my stuff on the Amiga. As you can see, it's got a little 3.5 millimeter jack there on one side, and it's got this kind of parallel port thing in the back, if you like, and it simply just plugs in, and you plug an output from whatever it is you want to sample into here and you get a reading on your Amiga. Again, this is, as you can see, it's really primitive, 8-bit style, so don't expect super duper quality, but what you will get with this is that uh, classic Amiga sound. As he said, it's a sort of like a, a plastic case, you know, it's put together pretty straightforward, that you can actually see the, um, the plug actually sticking out of the bottom with a little gap there and stuff, man, but this came in a box, special box, and um, it was pride and joy and still is today made by a company called Microdeal and as you can see this came out in 1990 so within a year we were sampling on this and putting using it to put tunes out um, and building tracks on that program called Optimed. Master Sound was a very very basic piece of software uh, there was a better version of this type of software that came out called Audio Master, which eventually went up to Audio Master 5. Audio Master 5 um, was legendary for its flanging effects and also its time stretch. So, guys, if you want to find out a little bit more about Amiga music and Amiga history, please subscribe and smash that like button. And if this video gets to 50 likes, I will upload another one. That's it for today. Take care. God bless. Peace. I'm a everyday